The inmate who pulled that weapon has been removed from that housing unit, but the local correction officers union says this attack shows just how dangerous their job can be. The attacks on our officers, um, you know, it needs to stop. Two Sousa Baranowski Correctional Center officers are recovering after an inmate fight broke out in a maximum security housing unit. Prisons are, are notoriously uh, a bad place to be. They're, they're dangerous. But what we've seen over the years, it seems that the increase in officer assaults has increased exponentially. The Department of Corrections says the fight happened between three inmates around six o'clock last night. When officers intervened, one of the inmates took out a homemade weapon. The knife and started to stab a correction officer in the head and the face area. That officer and one other were taken to the hospital and released later that night. The Massachusetts Correction Officers Federated Union says this underscores the dangers in prison. The inmates that are there are there for a reason. Uh, they're dangerous, they're assaultive. This isn't the first incident to happen in a Massachusetts prison this year. A six hour standoff happened at the Bristol County Jail one month ago. You can see inmates were able to break windows and even spray a fire extinguisher at correction officers. The union says serious attacks like these makes it difficult to find and keep employees. We're down over 30% uh, for what we should be. Uh, we're down approximately 1,000 correction officers, and that's happened over, over the years. The Department of Corrections says they will notify the Worcester County DA of this assault, and the assault does remain under investigation. We're live outside the Sousa Baranowski Correctional Center. Danae Bucci, WCVB.